The UN seeks ICJ's opinion on Israel's illegal occupation of Palestine following historic vote. A global airport's body hits back at quote unjustified COVID checks on travelers from China. A Qatar Airways flight makes an emergency landing. And finally, Ronaldo is facing fire once again. Stick around to find out why. Hi, it's Fatma and you're watching The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. It's a major blow to Israel. The United Nations is seeking the International Court of Justice's opinion on the legality of Israel occupation of Palestine following an overwhelming vote by member states on Friday. Qatar was among the majority of countries that voted in favor of the resolution which Palestinian officials described as a major victory for Palestine. Under the resolution, the UN requested the ICJ to provide an opinion on Israel's quote, occupation, settlement and annexation. COVID checks imposed by several European countries on passengers arriving from China are quote, scientifically unjustified and uncoordinated. That's according to the International Airports Council's European branch. European countries include France, Italy, Spain, and the United Kingdom, along with the United States, South Korea, and Australia, imposed COVID testing requirements on travelers from China this week. This comes as China faces a mass spread of COVID-19 across the country after dropping the zero COVID approach to dealing with the virus. Passengers en route a Qatar Airways flight from Brisbane to Doha on New Year's Eve reportedly saw, quote, something hanging from the wing shortly after takeoff. The quick-thinking passengers alerted the pilot who was forced to make an emergency landing early on during the 14-hour flight to Doha. Qatar Airways said it was a technical issue that caused the plane to return to Brisbane. And finally, Cristiano Ronaldo's prior remarks criticizing Xavi Hernandez or Xavi for playing in Qatar have resurfaced after the Portuguese confirmed his move to Saudi Arabia. The 37-year-old has agreed to a two-and-a-half-year contract with Saudi Arabia's Al Nasser despite previously expressing interest in playing in the Champions League and dismissing a future outside of Europe. The Portuguese superstar had previously said, quote, I want to finish with dignity in a good club. That doesn't mean going to the USA, Qatar, or Dubai is not good, but I do not see myself there. That's it for me today. For more stories, head over to our website, dohanews.co.